Capricorn, welcome back to the Illus Illuminator for your mid month. So let's go on and see what is going on with my dear Cappies. In love, what are the messages for Cappy? What is it? Divine wants Cappy to know around this time. Let's see. Happy Valentine's Day for everyone out there. You got the same card as uh, Sagittarius. Reclaim your authenticity. So, yeah, that was a very harsh reading for Sag, um, but it could be that you are also kind of like masking something, not really being in your authentic self, not expressing yourself, um, how you truly feel about a situation or about a person. Wow, okay, these are cards that Sag also had. Uh, the magic of the Coelian truth Jude, caution, secrecy, and worry, and honor the masculine, respecting men, embracing the masculine divine. I see that someone is in between you and a masculine energy, all right? This is, this is someone that is um, deceptive, all right? This is definitely a female figure. It could be due to uh, some magic that this person is trying to exert uh, by taking away your power, by taking away your authenticity, and either saying things or doing things that are a bit out of alignment with you and you needing to you know respect men but this is also respecting the masculine so this is your own masculine energy that you need to respect by taking action against this energy by being your authentic self showing who you truly are and realizing that you have been perhaps out of character all right in either masking a situation or masking what you feel masking um something within yourself all right whatever that case is all right so there's definitely someone here and this biatch <laughs> she's coming up quite some time in the readings now so I get the feeling that the energies have been quite switched and, and, and mixed up and messed up for no one to really understand or get clarity on what to do next, um, which is your own authentic self that is suffering from this situation, if you get what I mean. So let's see what else are the messages. Wow, obstacles, destiny, this is the wheel of fortune, obstacles and challenges, which is with the Coelian truth, all right? Someone is putting obstacles on your path and it's scaring you off of not tr speaking your truth or being yourself at this point. So you gotta be very careful there, Capricorn. You gotta be very, very careful here. This is someone that is blocking your path, that is blocking you energetically from getting where you need to be or taking away your masculine energy by you not pursuing because masculine energy is a pursuer they're the hunters right like they go after what they want that's the masculine energy they come with courage and everything when it says honor that masculine energy within yourself respect that within yourself that just means that you know you need to stop being in this mushy mushy stage state and go after what you want or face this this whomever this is all right so you you got to face this this energy and go against it transformation yeah your masculine energy is going through transformation could be also the masculine that you are dealing with uh they may be in a, in a process of putting an end to a situation or um a character within themselves so they can pursue but this magic of the Kulian drew that is in between both of you like look at that they both want to come towards one another but you know there is some kind of a secret that is holding both of you away from one another that is just piling up with the obstacles that's piling up with uh, with those challenges all right and this is this person that is trying to oh we just had the two of cups that just popped out out of the blue here all right so yeah that is definitely someone being in 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 between both of you Ooh, why are these energies so 
freaking heavy like all of them realization yeah there is there is a gateway there is a way to break this door open you got the key all right you just need to realize your own power and your own strength but this is also the number three which is talking about communication so only communication will you know bring answers and the right answers but with the hunger card you're really stuck in feeding your own fears feeding your own um, lack mentality so to speak and it's it's like what do you want to feed do you want a outcome that is positive do you want to get answers because you get the keyhole here so or do you want to continue feeding yeah this is the same kind of cards that uh, Sagittarius kind of had. This is the release card. So some of you need to release that hunger or the longing or the um, the need to feed the fear. There is definitely that release that needs to happen for you to feel free to be who you truly are and be in your authentic self in order to overcome these obstacles that has been put on your path by someone else. I don't really like those kind of energies, but, you know, it is what it is. You know, some people, you, do, you never know what some people are um, doing in their life. But someone is definitely trying to make you not go through this path. And blocking you from your destiny. Your dreams need a practical plan. So you, that is you. You are the practical Capricorn. So you got to do something that is practical, that is connected to your masculinity. So taking action, making practical plans on how you're going to overcome these obstacles. How you are not going to be the one each and every time that is just going to watch your own destiny unfold by the wrongdoings of other people. Wow, look at that. Oof okay cards fly out queen of cups there is definitely a water sign cancer pisces scorpio or someone that is having a lot of love for you but they're as well as much as confused as you are you got the knight of pentacles with the with the sagittarius card like i said there's a lot of sagittarius energy around you uh, that you need to either incorporate and be more flexible be more balanced be more um of both all right do not neglect your masculine energy by just only being in your emotions or only focusing on um on work or uh, trying to maintain your stability try to maintain your um, emperor kind of energy because the emperor does talk about taking action but sometimes when we misuse the emperor energy it's all about like forcefully being in control to an extent that it can burn us because that this this emperor looks like the devil all right in this deck so for me this is like you're trying to burn your identity by keeping too much control like stiff control in a situation all you really want to do is have a balance and reconciliation or uh, be in good terms at good terms with an individual and you need to do the right thing because that's the justice card the justice card is talking about doing the right thing even though that is against your um, feelings or against your mental state whatever it is you need to come from a place of justice honor of you know um doing the right thing that's what i'm seeing you know you, th these are wishes that you want to get fulfilled but you need a practical plan like how do you get that emotion how do you get that going first things first release that hunger that you have towards your ego or towards your fears or towards um not being strong enough to overcome these obstacles these are things that you may be telling yourself and this is a whole journey you know with whomever you are in connection with you both are coming towards the end of a journey and it needs to be transformed it needs to be transitioned into something new yeah, look at that, Libra. A new romantic cycle begins. A personal issue reaches resolution. So this is all about 
both of you needing to work things out and make a change in the situation and once you do that your hard work will pay off but you gotta work for it like this is a situation where you really need to work for it let's see about your person what's your person going through right now king of wands so you both are very stubborn all right you both are very stubborn um, I feel like they have a lot of attraction to you for you uh, they could be trying to overcome their own ego and pride as well because we got the Leo um, behind him so they're trying to you know put a how do you say it like put their best feet forward in the situation nine of pentacles they may be very distant right now or very much focused on their own freedom stability or uh, trying to be very practical at the same time but i feel like they are not very happy with the with the with the separation here all right you may be quite separate from one another but they feel your energy very strongly they feel like they want to offer you something but there is a struggle with commitment here yeah ace of pentacles But there will be a new beginning once you put an end to whatever it is that you need to release, Capricorn. So let's see what we got going on in your he says, she says spread. So if you want to uh, purchase that, the link is down in the description box below this video. And I'll see you guys very soon. Thank you. Bye.